In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a lanyard mockup in Canva. So the first thing you want to do once you're in canva.com, of course, you would have to log in and create an account if you don't have one. And then once you're in here, you want to click create a design up here top left. So tap on this. And from here, you want to go to custom size down here. So likely you will see this page first or this one, and then just click custom size. From here, I would suggest you actually put units from pixels, which is default, to millimeters, okay? And what I usually do for mockups, for especially for lanyard mockups, what I do is I put 450 by 25 millimeters, okay? So width 450, height 25. And then you wanna press create new design. And then in a few seconds, there we go, this will be generated as you can see over here. So what you can do from here is of course, we'd have to create two because there's one in the front side and one in the back side, so for both sides. Now, I'm gonna click duplicate page over here and then you can start editing it by adding in elements. So the first one, if you click elements over here, this will get fixed to the left and then you can start, for example, by adding this first part that is usually over here. So, you know, the one where some text comes on, let's say I want this one in, for example, uh, light blue color and of course because this is um, the back side I'm going to have it at the back side as well over here you can actually for easier navigation if you want the front and the back the same you can just create uh, the second page or the second side after you've created this one so let's say that's the first side so the front side and I want to create the back side as well you want to press plus now and this will duplicate this page and now as you can see it's the same on both sides so to then you can do whatever you want, of course. So I would recommend, of course, you do some backgrounds or maybe some text or whatever you wanna have on there. You can even upload your own files in here, but you can just search for example for some background. So we can tap up here where it says search elements and type in background. And over here, as you can see, you'll be able to find a lot of different things. So if I go to graphics right now, there's a bunch of different backgrounds that would definitely look cool. So let's just pick one for this instance. I don't know, for example, let's say I wanna pick this one over here, which is of course with the pro version, but for this, um, for this instance, you'll be able to see what I'm saying. So just like this, and then you just kinda reorder them as you want to, or resize it if you would like, it doesn't matter. And then as you can see, and now I kinda have the base of this, and then let's say I wanna put in some stars and I wanna type in stars. And then over here under shapes, I'm gonna go to graphics actually, there we go. I got a bunch of different stars. And then these, as you can see, can be resized perfectly so they can just fit. I'm holding down my alt key on my keyboard and just dragging away. And I'm just getting different copies of these stars. So there we go. And then for example, a few more here. Okay, so that's now kind of the basis. And then just edit it however you would like to edit this, put in whatever you'd like, put in some text over here maybe. And then of course, customize the other side as well. And as I said, if you just want both sides the same, I'm gonna just click this delete page and then the duplicate button. And there we go, it's the same on both sides. Now, once you're done with this and once you want to delete it, what you have to do is just press share up here and then from here, you wanna click download. When you click download, make sure it says PNG over here and make sure size is kept as it is. And make sure over here, it's selected all pages. Now, once you've done this, press download. And as you can see, it says, your design con uh, contains premium content, which means, of course, I can't download this without the watermark. However, for this instance, I showed you it the, the first thing I found, so it's quick and convenient for you. I'm gonna just download a free watermark draft right now, but in your case, you would have to, of course, either pay for this premium um, template or your premium um, design that you used, or just use the free ones inside Canva. So both work very well. And of course, depending on what you'd like to get, um, you will uh, essentially do accordingly. Now, once you've done this, you'll see that this has been downloaded onto your computer. And then on your computer, open up your downloads folder inside File Explorer, and you will see this zipped file, right click it, press extract all, and then extract. And in here, you can double click this. As you can see, I have my, my one and two PNG. And if I were to zoom this in, you can clearly see that those are those two images. If I open them up, there we go. That's the first one and that's the second one. So they're essentially the same, but still, if you create different ones, 
both will be downloaded. And that's pretty much it. That's how you create Lanyard mockups in Canva. I hope this video helped you out, and if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.